Hello and welcome to Animation Shorts 1. Today I'm going to show you guys how to make a file uploading site. And a sharing site as well. It's going to be all in one. So, what you're going to need is Macromedia Flash 8 or above. You're then going to need a site to um, host this upload system on and the sharing site. And you're going to need the code. So, basically, all you have to do is Google file upload or sorry flash 8 file upload and then hit enter I'm gonna have a link to the site that I'm talking about in the description box but for now um just follow along alright so scroll down here this is a tutorial on how to do it as well instead of reading all of this what is it like 15 pages I'm just going to show you guys how to do it the easy way. Alright. It says download the example files here. Click it. This is going to pop up your... Alright, there it is. Right click it. Open containing folder. Alright. And let's bring the tutorial out here. Let's close that. Let's open up Macromedia. There it is. Alright. Alright, there we go. Color scheme was changed. Alright, so it might take a second. Alright, sorry about that. It took a little bit. But whatever. Open up your tutorial zip file here. <clears throat> Excuse me. Open up your tutorial zip file here. And let's drag the dot .flash file onto the stage. As you can see, um, it imports everything right onto the stage. You don't have to worry about a thing. And now it's time to customize it. And let's name this, in my cases, SN50 File Upload. Oops. Upload System. We're now gonna switch the Power By by the name of our company. Powered by SN50.com. And now, let's, let's see. Uh, that's done. Let's move down here. And let's go to the code. We're going to right click it, select actions. And then, as you can see, these are the different file types that are allowed. If you want to add one, you simply copy and paste one, paste it after that. You go to here, you go to parameters, and then you add to it, um, right here. So very simple. I'm sure you can figure it out. If not, you can contact us on the forms. The forms will be in the description box. Um, no need to forget or anything. So yes. But to do what we have to do, let's scroll down to the very bottom, and it says, um, put your dom domain plus upload.php here. So what we need to do is put our domain name forward slash the directory that the upload.php file is in. So http colon forward slash forward slash sn50.com forward slash upload system is the folder I'm going to upload it to. And then forward slash upload.php. The PHP file is right here. Okay. Alright, so we have that. Let's close it. Let's save it by clicking Control S, both at once. Go to File, Export, Movie, and we're going to name this movie File Upload. Alright, File Upload 1, 2, 3, in my, in my case. Alright, let's select the quality to be 100% just because it looks better that way to our um, clients. Hit OK. It's exporting it. It's done. Uh, there it is. So now what we're going to have to do, we're going to open up our um, control panel to our site. In my case, I'm opening up my control panel to SN50.com. It'll take a second. Let me close that. Flash it. Alright. As you can see, I'm using HostGator. Um, let's go to File Manager. Give it a second. And while it's doing that, I'm actually going to 
drag out the upload.php file here. And now we have the we're gonna have to upload the upload.php file along with the file upload.123. So both those in the same directory in the same folder. Got it? Okay. And now we're gonna create a new folder called let me see what I named its directory here. Upload system. Alright. Upload system. Create new folder. Alright. And now let's go down and let's upload the two files, the upload.php and the uh, file upload123. Alright, so let's upload those two files. Uh, first one is upload.php and then our second one is file upload123. There it is. I'm sorry. Um, I'm going to have to exit out of that. And I'm going to have to go to upload system and upload them there. I uploaded them to the wrong directory, but that doesn't matter. Because I can just do it here. Okay, and file upload123. There we go. Now that the two files have been uploaded, well, not this one. Alright, just give it a second. Okay, come on. You can do it. Come on. Okay, I might have to pause the video because this is taking forever and I don't want to make this video longer than it has to be. Alright, finally it's done. Now we're going to have to create a new folder by clicking new folder and name it uploads. This is a folder that all of our uploads are going to go to by default. By default, I mean that the programmers who made this upload system made it so all the files would go to this folder. So let's test it out. Open up a new tab, go to your site forward slash the directory you saved it in, in my case. File let me see what I saved it under. Forgot. Upload system. Upload system forward slash file upload one two three dot s WF. Remember, it's a flash file. Okay, and just give it a second. Okay, we have it. Notice how it's really big. Well, that's because we haven't placed it in a .html page. So it's going to be that big until you resize it. Let's hit browse, image, and let's select, I don't know, let's just select that. Let me see if it works. Alright, it looks like it's working. Alright, it has been up uploaded. Okay, we see a typo, HA, HA, instead of HAS. So, to fix that, you simply have to make another executable and fix that problem. Not executable, another flash file. And let's say the person didn't know where this file was being uploaded to and they wanted to get it in the future. Well, what you can do is, you can go into the code here. Alright, and where it says status under dash text dot text plus equals the blah 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 right here. And so you just copy this and then you paste it down there. And then we delete this entire part right here because we don't need that. Alright? And now what we do is you can download your file at and then colon http forward slash your site sn50 dot com forward slash and now it's going to give the name of that file oh sorry i need to do upload system because mine's right there upload system forward slash alright so now if we were to save this out let me quickly do this oh wait i have to do the upload folder as well alright so now I'll check for errors contains no errors that's a good sign let's export it out again as the uh, file upload one two so we can tell the difference between the two and let's save it uh, let's close that let's re-upload it except this one's file one two file upload one two okay 